Hi guys, welcome back to Pepper Schism. I'm Jason. I'm Jason's wife. And we are going to review Heiko's Hot Sauce. Um, he's up in Canada. Uh, if you go to heikoshotsauce.com, you can pick up uh, a bunch of different flavors. But we're really here to do three, so we have... Canadian colon cleanser. <laughs> <laughs> we have his limited edition Devil's Brew. And we have uh, his seasonal, and I believe this is version two, of uh, Pumpkin Pyro. Mm. So this is Pumpkin Pyro 20. Okay, so first we're going to start with the Canadian colon cleanser. And check that out. Really cool. You can see all the little pieces of pepper in there. I like on the side how it gives like a scale of how hot it is too. There's, the, there's that. And it looks like it's down near off the charts there with a few Ooh. of these. Nice. And when you read it, on this one it has wild as the top. This one goes beyond wild. It oh goes no. devilishly wild. And this one is wild. Okay, mild to wild. Mild to wild. In our case, we got wild, wild, wild. Yeah. Wild, devilishly wild, wild. Devilishly wild. Let's do the devilishly wild last. Um, I'd like... Mind if we do this one last? Okay. This one is the one I'm most pumped about. Okay. Pumped. <laughs> Get it? Because pumpkin? Is that a... <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> All right. I'm going to start with the Canadian colon cleanser. Okay. Look at that crack. Oh. It smells really good. Mm, what is that smell? I don't know. It's like a smoky. It's like liquid smoke or something. Mm. Would you like to go first? Yes. Mm. Tasty? Yeah. It's refreshing. It's got like a nice. It's really sweet. Mm hmm. What's in it? Carolina Reaper, Ghost, Trinidad Scorpion, Habanero, Green, and Vidalia Onions, Apple Cider Vinegar, Water, Maple Syrup, Garlic, Fresh Herbs, and Spices. The maple syrup and the garlic, I believe, is. I what. think, yeah, <laughs> the maple syrup is what I smelled, but I thought it was liquid smoke. I don't know how I made that, like, weird connection but it's something earthy like an earthy smell mm. you know mm. really that's good. really good it burns your mouth like my lips are a little bit on fire mm -hmm. but it's good it's like it's a nice balance so the cat opened the door <laughs> and we'll probably move the camera and we're probably going to have to start this video over. It's fine. We've done it before just now. So. Next, we have the limited edition Devil's Brew. I love the packaging, Heiko. I love his picture. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> That's really funny. It's funny. And so this one's supposed to be a notch hotter. Because the other one was wild, and this one's devilishly wild, right? This one, yes, I believe, is devilishly wild. Okay. It's yum. The first one tastes like a good tink. Like, it tastes like tink with stuff in it, you know? Mm-hmm. It's nearly a meal by itself. Yeah. It's thick. It's Both of them thick. are thick. It's got big chunks. I feel like this one's thicker than the first one. Okay. <laughs> I 
I just like barely taste it. I mean, I don't like, I really, really taste it, but I barely tasted it. He need all because I didn't want to get hiccups, which I feel like I messed up because I feel the hiccups are going to start. <laughs> it's really hot. That's really good. It's definitely hotter than the first one. And um, both of them are really good flavor, though. And on this one, we have Chili Peppers, oh. uh, Carolina Reaper, okay. Morgan Scorpion Ghost, and uh, we got the Vidalia Onion, uh, Mangoes, mm. Peaches, Freshly Squeezed Lime Juice, Roma Tomatoes, Garlic, Apple Cider Vinegar, Water, Maple Syrup, Fresh Herbs and Spices. Mm. I knew it had tomatoes, Wouldn't too. be Canadian without the maple syrup. Oh, I forget he's Canadian. Limited Edition Devil's Brew. You know, honestly, I think I like this one maybe a little bit more than the last one. I don't know. They're different, but man. Yeah, the other one, I like the consistency of it. Like how it's chopped up and you can, like I said, it's kind of like a meal by itself. So I think both of them are like that. They're real good. Last one we got. There it is. Heiko's Harvest Hot Sauce. Pumpkin Pyro. Mm, pumpkin. And it's on the wild scale. Mm. Once again, we get to hear that bottle crack. Great pump, great packaging. I like the Excellent difference in packaging. color. This one has definitely got a lot more. It's more pureed. It's really, really, really nice looking. After you. <laughs> mm. That's my favorite. Oh. That is so good. That is crazy That good. is so good. This doesn't need to be seasonal. This needs to be yeah. every day, all day. Bring it on, Heiko. It is literally pumpkin. Holy moly, that is good. It's like pumpkin pie meets Reapers. It is. That's the best thing I've tasted in a long time. Love this. What's in it? Uh, the ingredients are, of course, you know... Chili peppers, uh, yellow and red Carolina reapers, yellow and red, mm. reaper beast peach, yellow ghost, uh, I believe that says lemon bob, I haven't heard of that one, that's new for me, mm. uh, pumpkin, Vidalia onion, water, apple cider vinegar, uh, freshly squeezed lime juice, maple syrup, fresh herbs and spices, allspice, cloves, and cinnamon, there we go. Thanksgiving in a bottle, but super hot. Have y'all ever had peach um, peach cobbler baby food? Okay, just hear me out. When I was a teenager, I would I would go to the store and like I would get it all the time. And it's dumb for a teenager to like it, but it was just something. It was a weird quirk, and that's kind of what it tastes like. It looked like it has a little bit of that in. Of course, it's way hotter than baby food would be, mm -hmm. but it's got like that, like, oh. You need to if you have if you haven't if you don't we don't have kids so we don't really have a real reason to have baby food but you need to try that and then tell me if you don't think it tastes kind of like that with hot sauce in it. Uh, like I it, can't remember the last time I tried it, but I don't need to. And it's the same is, consistency. It's like perfectly blended. Heiko, make this happen year round, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Even if you can't find pumpkins year round, if you just did the peaches. Because you can taste, you can definitely taste peaches in it too. Yeah. That's, that is amazing. I that is great it. sauce. All three of them are great. Mm -hmm. They're all different. Um, man, but that, that Harvest Hot Sauce, that, that's where it's at. Wow. I, you know, I, and I never would have thought that I would like, you know, cinnamon and things like that in a hot sauce. Um, and the pumpkin, you know, it's it definitely holiday flavor. Um. I'm a, I give that like two thumbs up. He's got a lot. He's got a talent with um, blending the hot with the right amount of sweet. 
Because yeah. all three of them had that going on. But that one is just so good. Like, all of them are good, but that one's my favorite. That was really good. Well, all right. There we go. Uh, great. All three sauces are great. Yeah. Love them. Heiko, great job, dude. You knocked it out of the park. And um, Four thumbs up. Four thumbs up. <laughs> And we'll catch you on the next review. Please uh, like and subscribe to our channel. And uh, we'll keep doing these. Thank you all.